Hey, Seth, great win by you guys. Great energy in that second half, but you got the pace going. I tell you what, you can shoot that three ball, a high arcing shot, and you see nothing but the bottom net. What are your thoughts on the game? Yeah, uh, I thought we had a lot, lot to clean up, but we did a lot. We did a lot right, you know, uh, four or five weeks together with me being here. So, um, yeah, we got a lot to clean up, but we did a lot right on the defensive end because that's going to be our bread and butter all year. We're going to have to guard people. So, you know, there's always stuff we can do a little bit better. But overall, proud of our effort, proud of the, the way we communicated. So the things we set out to do tonight, we did them. Um, and now we just look forward to celebrate this for just a little bit and then right back to the ground. Yeah, absolutely. Obviously, again, in, in that second half, just the, the tempo and energy kind of spruced up a little bit. Was Sam Armstrong just wanting a bit more on the defensive end? Yeah, yeah. It's definitely uh, it's a push from all the guys, from the coaching staff and the guys um, on the squad. We want to play fast. We want to play at tempo. We think that that's one of our, uh, one of our strengths. So anytime we can get to that, um, we know it's going to be good for us because we can guard fast, we can play fast, and I think we have really good decision makers. So as long as we can get going up and down the court and still stay sound, then we're going to be in a good shape. Absolutely. Now, you've still got one import to come in, but how, you've been here now for a few weeks now. How are you enjoying Tasmania and enjoying this part of the state here in the northwest coast? Oh, it's unbelievable. The weather's been perfect. Everyone tells me it's going to keep getting uh, cold and rainy, but I've only seen... 20 Celsius and sunny, so been able to get to the beach. Never been by the beach before, so soaking that in. Um, love the people, love the area. Um, and like you are saying, we've still got uh, another port, uh, important piece coming in. So he's a force to be reckoned with, and we can't wait till he gets here. Uh, absolutely, Seth. And uh, I tell you what, it's nice to have this place packed out, and I'm sure you would have been informed about the robbery against the Chargers. This is like a big game within the NBL 1 South season. Yeah, absolutely. Any win in the NBL 1 is a, a great win, and especially one over the, the you know, cross Tasmania rivalry there so it's good to get them early they're going to be a lot better we're going to be a lot better so hopefully we can uh, we can pack it out when we go down there too but the crowd here was amazing amazing tonight I mean it was as loud as you could want it sometimes we couldn't even hear our own play call so yeah, it's just how you want it and, and Seth just a bit of a background on you obviously you played overseas and obviously played your your college ball in America as well too like how how, how cool is this coming down to a small state in Tasmania and then of course we've just won the national championship in the NBL like how biggest that you're walking into right now? Oh, I, I would describe it as just pride in basketball. There's a, a pride in the basketball culture here. I was uh, over at a friend's house. We were watching the Jack Jumpers win the grand final, and it was uh, basically the happiest I think I've ever seen them in their lives. I've only known them for a short time, but it was such a big feat, um, and obviously there's so much that goes into basketball here, and that's what makes it beautiful. That's what makes it bring it to such a high level here. So, yeah, I think it's, uh, it's incredible for the Jack Jumpers. That's insane to watch. Absolutely, Seth. Great game by you tonight. Hey, best of luck next week. It's a home double header as well too. So what's the team? So before we quickly wrap this up, what does the team have to do to get ready for two straight home back-to-back -back games? Yep, um, just the normal stuff. Early season, where you got to get on the same page a little bit more. Just kind of keep building habits. Uh, energy, motor, and uh, intent was never in question tonight. So I think we're locked down on that. Um, so now it's just a little bit of the X's and O's. What can we clean up? offensively and defensively. Uh, and then as we play together more, we're just going to get a whole lot better. So just building chemistry. Lovely. Thanks for your time, Seth. Yep. Thanks, Ronald. Appreciate you. <laughs>